Hey there, Christopher Thunder here, coming at you from the World's Dirtiest Workshop. I am here working with my tail light and turn signals. Okay, so here is the harness coming off of that piece. And you can see all of the connectors are color-coded and uh, they have symbols on them too. And all of these do as well. So now that I've got this completely separated from the bike, now I can take this and workbench it. So I'm gonna, you know, clean this thing off and take it inside and watch a little Pink Floyd and um, put a nine volt battery to it and watch the lights light up. And uh, I should be able to tell if there's a problem at this end. Now, if there's a problem at this end, okay, I've got some work to do. If not, I have to figure out a way to extend the turn signal lines so that um, they're less likely to break. So this is an aftermarket component. Yes, it, it has its problems, but I want to fix the design and maybe even make a metal shield in there so that the wires are no longer a risk. And that's what I've had for some time now. I was always afraid that I get a twig uh, wrapped up in the tire or something like that, and it would spin around and tear the wires out. So uh, that's always been a problem. Uh, I will show you close up what that is like. So you can see here that the wires just kind of come through there. That is not the best design. Um, you really want to protect those. And I did with some electrical tape, but you can see that they're still, you know, too tight. They're too short. And um, something can get under there and get a hook on that and rip them out. So, yep, uh, these are the things you got to think about when you're building the perfect bike. Um, I had a really great uh, turn signal system and tail light system, and I really liked it. Um, I just didn't like the wiring. So it's time to do some improving here. Um, and then I'm going to put it all back together and ride it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.